Hey guys, Abolitionist Jay here. It's about uh, 3.30 in the morning on what's now June 20th, right? Today's Wednesday? Sure. <laughs> you know me, I, I forget to look these things up, but yeah, I'm pretty sure it's now officially the 20th. Murder Dog and I are at a rest stop off of uh, Route 80 in Pennsylvania just before the border to Ohio. I think we're like 30 miles short. We, uh, we drove for quite a bit tonight. Originally we were going to stop at one of the state parks um, in the Allegheny region, but as I started to get closer I finally turned Waze on because my battery was having an issue on my phone. For some reason it wasn't, it was taking forever to hold the charge. I think it's my new uh, power inverter I got. I don't think the USB charges as fast as uh, the plugs, do, you know, plugging things in does. Anyway, uh, when I finally turned it on, I realized that uh, the park was about 30 mi almost 30 miles off Route 80, and uh, so that meant I would be going like 25, 30 miles out of my way, and uh, I thought, well, that's just silly, and I figured, all right, well, I'll just stop at the next rest stop instead, and the next rest stop was like five miles or less after that exit, which would have taken us to the park. And uh, so I said, all right, we can make it one more, because I think the science is on like, you know, 50, like 60, you know, 58 miles to the next one. I said, all right, we can do that. And we did. Barely made it. Started to get really sleepy. Um, but yeah, so we're stopping here for the night. Like I said, I, was, I wanted to do the, par the park and camp there, although we were probably going to sleep in the car anyway, since we were going to get there so late. But then maybe go for a nice hike in the morning or something and uh, do a video there. But just didn't make sense to go that far out of the way. And in the end, we drove f like 15 minutes longer than what it said it would have taken us to get to the park. And we ended up like 60 miles further west. So, yeehaw, we're in better shape for tomorrow. So now I'm going to try to get some sleep and... Uh, I think, I thought for a second this was the rest stop, Nordic Dog and I stopped at a couple of years ago, but I think we stopped at the one just before this, a couple of years ago, but anyway, um, we're going to try to get some sleep, and then uh, whenever we get up in the morning, we get up, I already got the, uh, well it's going to be hard to see, but all the blackout shades are up already, so we'll sleep as late as we can, and then uh, we'll get up and continue on our way. We got to uh, get in touch with our friend, the Wandering Agar Agarist. I saw he left me a message on Steemit to connect with him on the fascist book, uh, just so we can coordinate meeting up. But uh, yeah, we're more than halfway there, so there should only be, like if I was to drive straight to the Circle Pine Center, I think there's only like another five plus hours, maybe five and a half hours. Um, not sure exactly how long it's going to take me to get to this place in Astigo, but We'll figure that out tomorrow. Either way, um, as tired as I am, this, I think this was the right decision because um, I got half the trip knocked out and I don't have to worry about scrambling in the morning and we ran into enough construction and bullshit tonight anyway that it just would have infuriated, infuriated, yeah, I can't say the word right now. It would have made me even more mad <laughs> uh, dealing with that tomorrow when I was trying to rush to make sure I got to the campsite before I got dark, so. Anyway, with that, I will sign off, and uh, we'll check back in with you tomorrow. It's been Abolitionist Jay. <laughs> oh. Peace, y'all.